Well, hey guys, how's it going? Frank Slauson here, and uh, yeah, well, 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 another another day, another vlog, and another great adventure. I don't know. <laughs> oh, well, I was uh, uh, hoping that I would have got a little bit more uh, feedback on my uh, video that I put up yesterday, the day one of the vlogs. I know it wasn't really that that great. It wasn't really that special. But uh, as we as time moves on, I'm sure eventually the uh, the vlogs will be a little bit better. I don't know. You know, I don't know what I'm really trying to go. You know, what I'm going for here. You know, as far as what goal I'm trying to set to whatever, because I don't have that many subscribers, and you know, it's probably gonna be a while till I actually do get a fair amount. Anyway, I wish I'd have just as many as you know, wet movie or even you know, cool dude or whatever. But yeah. I guess it'll just take a little bit of time. Hell, I wish I had as many subscribers as Shay Carl with the Shay Tarts, but the only reason why he has so many subscribers in the first place is because he works for YouTube, and that's why. <laughs> that's the only reason why. I'm pretty sure, you know, because he works there. YouTube pays him to to do what he, you know, to do his thing. So, oh man, what to talk about? What to talk about? You know, uh, a lot. Of people have been talking about their YouTube story just recently here about a month ago or not even a month ago maybe a few weeks ago a couple weeks ago YouTube celebrated its fifth birthday and uh, I did I had totally didn't really realize that they've been around for five years I didn't realize that they started in May of 2005 or about 2005 because I I actually started watching YouTube in 2006 I didn't actually start watching that until 2006 Started watching videos or whatever of, of things, and because uh, when I was on the radio, I used to uh, do, I used to use YouTube a lot for re research and whatnot for my show and all that stuff, and uh, used to use a lot of the videos, you know, in audio format for my shows and whatnot to kind of make it sound even cooler than it probably really was. If I make it sound cooler than it probably would have not have sounded if I would have used, you know, the sources that I had. At the time, anyway, uh, YouTube has been around for five years now, and I figure, well, I'll share you with you guys a little bit of my story, my YouTube story. Uh, pretty much, it, it it all pretty much started for me, like I said, in 2006 when I was on the radio, and I didn't really, I didn't, I didn't really make an account until 2008. But I I used the the like I said the videos and all that for research and. I use some of it for my shows and all that. And you probably wonder, well, how could you use it for your radio show? It's radio. It's not television. Well, we have a thing at the station where you can actually uh, record the audio. Like if it was like a song or a or an interview or something, you could record it and then just play it through the uh, through the uh, audio net or whatever. A lot of people don't know that. A lot of stations are like that. They have access to the uh, to the to the web server and then through the uh, the uh, broadcast of Ruth and whatnot. Anyway, so yeah, I mean it, it started with that, and then uh, when I actually started getting serious about YouTube, it wasn't actually until about 2008, January 2008, I started on YouTube uh, with my Frankie Aces 56701 account, and that was just you know to try it out to see what it was all about, you know, because before that I was just a viewer, I was never really a video maker. Uh, and then, well, 2008, I made my account, and then, you know, enjoyed it here and there. I didn't really do a whole lot for videos, just kind of, I didn't really have an actual nice camera like I got now. Uh, I use what a lot of people used to use back in the day, before most people started being serious about it, uh, their webcams. And the webcam, you know, unless you have a really good webcam, the video quality is going to be really nice, and the audio quality will be nice, but if you have a crappy webcam, yeah, it's not going to be that great. I didn't have that great of a webcam. I I had, I, I don't think it was a Logitech I had. I, I think it was just, uh, oh, HP, I think, Hulid Packard. Or no, it was a Philips. It was a Philips webcam. And that was horrible. You go back to some of those videos that I made in Frankie Aces 56701, uh, yeah, you would definitely see the difference. It was just horrible. But it was the only source that I had. <clears throat> it was the only resource that I had at the time so eh, whatever <laughs> uh, 
But it wasn't until about a few months later, after I got bar, yeah, I think it was after I went to Astoria, Oregon, I, I actually just started using YouTube more, and then I actually stopped using my Frankie Aces 5701 account, and I made my new account, Frankie Slots and Show. And, and of course, you know, the rest is history. But I, I, I started to think about doing it because in April of that year, of 2008, I... I see, and that's where I was first met, introduced to Cool Duder, Sean C. Phillips, and MJ Kelly, because then I would start watching their videos. But how I found them was I was looking, at the time I was uh, in the process of doing a radio interview with, who here knows who Elon Mitchell Smith is? Anybody? I'm sure some of you guys do. Uh, if you don't know, he, uh, his uh, main gig was the fact that he played Wyatt in the movie Weird Science. And a lot of people don't know that, you know, because he's just one of those, to some people, he's just a one-hit wonder, kind of. But he actually, I found him, uh, he's actually a teacher at Texas A&M, and he's also doing some stuff in California as well. He's a mythology teacher, whoever would ever have thought, right? Uh, and the thing about him is he, he kind of wanted to forget about, he wants people to forget about his acting days. He doesn't, you know, he doesn't want to be known for that, and I don't understand why. But that's another story for another time. Anyway, I was trying to find him. I was going to do an interview with him. We weren't able to do the interview because he was he was too busy and he want he wanted to talk more about his his mythology stuff than than his acting career. And I wanted to talk more about his acting career because that's all I knew about him. I didn't really know I don't know much about Greek mythology and all that stuff and the Mayan mythology and all that stuff. I don't I don't you know it's not my thing. I want to talk about his acting days. And in a lot of interviews that he's done, he's that's all he's ever talked about. But uh, I guess I could see how that could get kind of old after a while, you know, talk about the same thing. But it's what brought you to the dance, and what it, what people will always remember you by. Anyway, so Sean C. Phillips, uh, t I think he tagged, or not tagged, but he wrote on one of his info things, Elon Mitchell Smith. I think it was through like his favorite 80s videos or whatever. For 80s comedy DVDs or whatever, and Weird Science just happened to be in there, and I'm sure I would have found him, you know, either way, but I found him through that, and it was because of the, the videos that Sean and MJ did that inspired me enough, as well as a lot of other people, to make their own, make a better channel, to do their own things, to do their own around the town videos, DVD updates, CD updates, whatever, and yeah, and that's what I've been doing. And now I'm doing daily summer vlogs. So that's a little synopsis of my YouTube history. This video is going to be kind of short but sweet. Not too much editing in this one. But you guys tune in tomorrow. I guarantee it'll be a little bit more interesting video because we won't be at work. We'll be at home. And we will be uh, doing a review on the movie Banshee. I just got it on DVD here. And we're going to be reviewing it doing a proper review of Banshee tomorrow in tomorrow's vlog so we'll see you guys tomorrow on Frankie Slaughter's show daily summer vlogs